Oh wow. Oh look at it. Tell you what, I've never had to work so hard for a home tour in all my life. <laughs> How extra is that? because they've got these epic pods in the woods which we're going to be checking out but not only that are you excited about mountain biking <laughs> when was the last time you're on a mountain bike i don't think i've ever been mountain biking have ever you? i don't think i have what? yeah but really? they said no experience required so i'm oh. going by that i'm we'll actually test, really excited we'll test out that <laughs> The closest I get to mountain biking is like 45 minutes of spin class, so that's going to be interesting. But no, I am really excited. A little bit different to a spin class, I reckon. Somewhat, yeah. somewhat different. Um, so I'm really excited to meet Tara and Steve. We've got, how much longer have we got to go? Two and a half hours. Two and a half hours. The cracking scenery though. Beautiful scenery. What a spot. Check in soon. Mountain bike people are what? Mountain bike people everywhere. I'm feeling very intimidated. This is not my comfort zone. But this is a very beautiful town. I'm excited. We're about to meet Steve. We're about to go on an adventure. It's a pretty special How place to ride bikes. How long have you been bikes. here? Um, we have come out four years in April. Four years, Yeah, wow. of operation, but like Tara and I are Tasmanian, so um, been here since birth. So when Global people come in and do your experience, you're the pods and the ride, so it's the full experience, right? And you do tailored packages for people. Um, we do, but we do um, mainly operate as a luxury adventure mountain bike experience, which is a three day or a four day, all inclusive. So people are coming um, mainly from mainland Australia with perhaps carry on luggage and we take care of everything like really? snacks, alcohol, beautiful gourmet food. When we opened in 2017, um, that was actually the first time that Australia has ever attracted the Enduro World Series mountain bike event. So this is this event where maybe well, actually, there's hundreds of professional riders go to about eight different locations worldwide yeah. to ride the best trails as fast as they can. So it's, it's kind of the premier discipline for mountain biking now. So wow. Australia's here going, like, I wonder if we could eventually get it. Anyway, Derby comes online <gasps> and um, and they they come here. So they you know, stop off incredible. in Italy, France, Canada, then Tasmania. Okay, all right. Challenge accepted, but... I guess easier to go down than going up, right? Some people are much more scared of going down than up and others um, are the other way around. Okay. It's a, always a game between your mind and your fitness, I guess. Okay. So. All right. Well, this will be interesting. All right. What have you got in store we'll, for we'll us start, then today? We'll start, um, start gently. All right. Yeah. Feeling confident? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How much is this like a spin class? Yeah. Very little. Yeah, not like a spin class at all. So She's um, like, ride, ride! <laughs> jump up and under the pedals. <laughs> but what we're about to do um, is head up um, long shadows uh -huh. and then back down. So half climbing, half descending. Okay. But there's some really nice bends at the end to get some photos. Cool. Oh my God, how gnarly are we going now? 
feel nervous. Okay. All right. There we go. Sorry, that was not smooth, but bless you. What? This is like not riding a bike at all. This is totally, this is not like riding a bike. I don't, I'm like, I think it's a mixture of like adrenaline slash cardio. <laughs> Do you hear that? Hey, young. Okay. <laughs> Maybe you should go ahead of me. No. No, no, I can just feel it bounding out of my chest. minutes of mountain biking. Goodness. That was Good awesome. fun. That was actually fun. The last little bit. bit. You might make a mountain biker out of me yet, Steve. I, I know that we will. <laughs> I might need a few more days. If you practice. improve that much from the um, fire road to the single track. Is that okay? Like, An yeah. intermediate, right? We went that straight on to super, blue. Okay, all so right. We went straight on to blue. All right. Is blue not intermediate? No, what blue's is intermediate. Okay, yeah, it starts right. at green, okay. um, which is really cruisy. So we tipped you in the deep end. All right, sweet. And you're still swimming. <laughs> yeah. It's good. Okay. Really good. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to clean up. I want to check out these pods. Woo! Oh, wow. Oh, look at it. I'll tell you what, I've never had to work so hard for a home tour in all my life. <laughs> Should we go inside? Let's have a look. Gosh. Oh my goodness. Gosh, I love this. It feels almost like a boat, doesn't it, Jono? I love this. It does. These. It feels like when you're on the on a boat and you've got limited headroom and curves and angles and I love how how good is I just love this that how it's centralized around the bed but then they've kind of got this inbuilt sofa on either side. How and I like this. That's clever. Well, gosh it's so simple but so effective. Plenty of space. Oh my gosh. I love it. Oh this is comfy. I feel like I'm camping. This is like the most premium though. This is like glamping if it was camping. So this actually converts into they've got them set up as two singles like he was saying and then so he pieces these these come out and then you've got your couch bit in the middle and then you've got two single beds but we've maxed out very cute very romantic anyway i was getting a drink bye what are you sneaking i'm helping myself because it's allowed they said help yourself I reckon you might need to check on your kettle. Yeah, hang on a minute. Oof, hot. And I want to show you something. Ready? There's so many secret drawers here. So, secret drawer number one. Not that secret. The fridge. Help yourself. And another fridge. Help yourself. And another fridge? Yeah, look at all this good stuff. Look at all this beautiful wine. That's not actually what I want to show you. How do we open this again? So sick. Oh. <laughs> Got yourself. Got myself. You I'm showing yourself. you and I'm fooled myself. It's actually What's the other one? This one. It's way more secret. What? 
This is so cool. It's a little secret library study come chill out zone. It's got games, it's got books, it's got everything you want. This probably would be one of my favorite spots, I think. I like this. I also like the fact that you could then like chill out here, shut the door. If you don't want to like <laughs> talk to anyone, you can hide in here. If you need to get away. Yeah, I just love it. Yeah. Fresh off the roof. Fresh off the roof. Let me pour you a glass, sir. Oh, well, thank you. You're welcome. Why do you mm. stitch me up? Because you love your water. What have we got? What have we got? So you've got um, red cow dairy um, breed, you can breed. Oh and gosh. they do really beautiful baby breeds like this, which is like perfect for a couple. Yeah. yeah. Baby breeds. Baby breeds. Mm. I love it. Um, this is the Pine Garner um, Semi Hard, which is northeast. And this oh, yeah. is my all time favourite of theirs. Just a nice amount of bite. I love it. That Just is a amazing. nice combination of things. So this is a starter. <laughs> Just a cheeky stuff. Yeah, yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Thank you so much Cheers. for having us. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs>